Hey guys, Sock here from Socky Tech, and in today's video, we have a brand new update to the Samsung Galaxy Note 20 Ultra that does bring over a powerful feature from the Samsung Galaxy S21 Ultra. So it's been trickled down to our phones. So if I go to my settings right now, and I do want to let you know this is a Samsung Galaxy Note 20 Ultra. This is an unlocked US model. You may have already gotten this update or maybe you'll get it today or maybe in a few days. But we do have a new software update that's available. If I go all the way down, if I go to software update, you'll see if I tap on download and install, uh, we have a bunch of new things happening here. The update is supposed to be 437 megabytes. It's got the latest security update. And if you look over here, it says the performance of the camera has been improved, but they also forgot to mention that now we have that feature a new camera feature in the camera app as well, which I'm going to show you in a minute. Then we have the enhanced quick share. I'm going to talk about that as well. We do have some updates to the quick share. And then we have some other uh, security improvements and performance improvements. So let's dive in and get started. Now, real quick, if you want to download this wallpaper that I showed you in the very beginning of the video, it's a free wallpaper for your Samsung phone. All you want to do is click the link down below. Once you're at the website, scroll down just a little bit and go to wallpaper number three, and it's gonna be uh, taken to the store, and it's gonna be a free download. Now let's go in here and update our smartphone, all right? So I'm gonna tap on this, tap, and download right now. I'm gonna be right back after the installation is in fact complete. All right, so the software is now up to date, so let's go in here real quick. Settings, go all the way down, tap on software update, last update, and we are in fact good to go. Now real quick, I do wanna show you guys, uh, I'm gonna talk about the brand new feature that was added, but before that, let's go to about phone, go to software information, and if you go all the way down, you are gonna see we have the latest security patch, and as always, if you click this guy, it will take you to the website, and from that website, you can actually see exactly what has been updated as far as security is concerned by clicking that Samsung link and it will break everything down for you if you like that kind of stuff. So that's that. Let's talk about the new feature. So you launch the camera and then what happens is when you tap on more, now what you have is you have the brand new dual recording option. Now this is known as director's view in S21 and it's a little bit more advanced, but here if I tap on this one, basically what's happening is we have the front facing camera, which is this one right here, where you see my hand in that little screen, and the rear camera, which is right now black, working at the same time to give you a split recording experience. You can also tap over here and get actual split screen view, as you can see. So that's the front camera right here, and this is the rear camera. Let me show you guys some real life examples of what this feature actually is doing. So this is the picture in picture view. My face is, the front facing camera is on the top right as you can see, and the main camera, the rear camera is looking uh, towards everything else. And this here is the other option. Again, my face is using the front facing camera and everything else, the house and the trees, is the rear facing camera. You can have the split screen dual recording design uh, for some creative uh, video recording. All right, so that is the new dual recording option. Fantastic option. Now let's move on and talk about the quick share. So this is something that's been enhanced in these phones. So if I swipe over, let's see where that is for me. It's right over here. So when you uh, click and hold on quick share, it expands. Now quick share is the ability to share files between Samsung devices at high speeds wirelessly. It's like the airdrop feature on Apple. Now with the latest update, you can now do perform a quick share between this phone and the new Samsung Galaxy laptops. So if you bought one of those new laptops, the Galaxy Book, the Book Pro, it's now gonna work. You're gonna be able to instantly transfer files from here to the laptop wirelessly or from the laptop to the phone. So that's a fantastic option. On top of that, the quick share feature is now working even faster. The transfer speeds are faster. And one thing I did forget to mention in the camera, uh, even though they have added a new feature, they also uh, made some stabilization improvements to the camera. So even when you go to the photo 
And when you zoom in, okay, let's, let's say you go to 50 times zoom, the stabilization is going to be better. Uh, the overall camera performance is going to be better. Focus is going to be faster. So there's a lot of stuff going on with this new update. Security patches, camera improvements, quick share improvements, and many under the hood uh, stability improvements to the overall experience. I already feel as if it's a little bit faster, okay? So let's go back inside. If you have any questions, comments, or concerns, drop them down below and let me know. And remember, this is a Note 20 Ultra unlocked US model. So you may get the update today. Maybe you already got it if you're in another region, or you might get it in a couple days. All right, guys, have a fantastic day. All right, so if you found this video useful, make sure to subscribe to Saki Tech by clicking that button, and also click that bell icon on the side to make sure you get notified every time I upload a new video. And if you do use Twitter, Instagram, or Facebook, you can follow me at Saki Tech Online to get the latest updates as well. All right, have a fantastic day.